So as you can see, I'm still in Greece and at the moment I haven't even got a like quiet place to record this so my apologies the sound on this is going to be terrible and there is some bar music playing in the background so there's every chance that although it sounds like generic bar music it will turn out to be copyrighted by someone and this video will get pulled off of YouTube because they'll claim that uh, clearly I, I just don't have a quiet place to be. But what I wanted to say this week is that I'm, I'm in Greece and the heat wave from the UK has now reached Greece. I'm kind of okay here because we're on quite a small island and the sea is moderating the situation, although it's still really hot. In Athens it has been 40 and that's not so extreme for Athens, but it's still pretty extreme and it's still the same heat wave. And what has surprised me so much about what's going on in terms of the weather in the UK is that politicians are still not talking about it. Like I understood when they were like, oh, I don't get climate change because it doesn't seem to be having any real impact yet. It's like a prediction. And I sort of understood when it was affecting people in Africa and in Asia, but it didn't seem to be affecting people in Europe. But now we're at a stage where it is staring us in the face. Like you, you know, you step outside and things are on fire. Things are burning, including people who step outside who are absolutely frying and still they're talking about other things, they're bickering about trivia, they're sort of handing out pleasantries, talking about the economy and, you know, how to build the economy. Even Labour saying their number one priority is building the economy and then the Tory leadership candidates talking about deporting a few hundred refugees when the whole planet is on fire. And I guess I always thought that when it was actually directly causing pain and suffering to us that they would wake up and I don't know what's left are we literally going to Armageddon in a sort of oh look over there oh that's weird isn't it what is everybody's favorite accent what kind of juice is best for your health like why are we still discussing trivia when this is going on and in the midst of all this I'm trying to write a show for Edinburgh but You'll be glad to hear that that show is not about trivia. It's going to be about all of these issues. And sure, there'll be funnies. I've deliberately written some funnies in because we kind of need them. But we need to talk about the big issues. And if you are coming up to the Fringe, it's called Kate Smirthwaite, Humanity's Last Hope. And it's 7.40 at the Banshee Labyrinth. Um, I would love to see you there. And uh, I'll speak to you again from, uh, from the UK in a few days. <laughs>